And today I'm going to be making buttermilk crispy spicy chicken and bacon homemade burger and I'm also going to make beef burger with cheese, lettuce, tomato and saute onion. Father God, you deserve it, God. My hallelujah belong to you, Jesus. You deserve it, God. Glory belong to you, God. Honor belong to you, God. You are a way maker, God. You are my light in the darkness, God, and I love you with my whole heart, God. Thank you for being God. Thank you for being the God that you are, God. Thank you, God, for allowing us to see another day, God. A day that we'll never see again, God. A day that I'll never take for granted, God. Yet, let your will be done, Jesus. My hallelujah belong to you, God, and I just want to serve you with my whole heart, God. Thank you, Jesus, for all that you have done. Blessing, glory, and honor belong to you. Thank you, Jesus, for blessing me. Thank you for loving me. Thank you for using me, God. Let your will be done, God. Thank you for the peace that surpasses all understanding who keep their heart and mind stay on you, God. I'm not perfect, God, but I know I love you, God. I know I'm going to worship you, God. Thank you, God, for forgiving us of every sin, God, known and unknown sin. Continue to cover us under your blood because there is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus to break every chain. And I thank you, God, for everything that you have done. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So, guys, this is my beef burger. I have two chicken breasts that I, that I already clean and wash with vinegar and lemon. I'm going to go ahead and show you how I season my chicken. I'm going to put one teaspoon of all-purpose season, one teaspoon of garlic powder, because remember it's only two breasts. You don't need a lot. I'm going to put one teaspoon of crushed pepper. I'm going to put one teaspoon of paprika just for coloring. One teaspoon of black pepper. And I'm also going to put some cayenne pepper. Like half a teaspoon. Because I'm also going to put some in the flour. So I'm just going to go ahead and mix this in. You just mix this in. Just like this. You could use also a knife and just juke it in, but be careful so the season goes straight in. Just like that. I'm gonna rinse my end off. Because I want to open my buttermilk. This is the bill. This is the milk that I'll be using. You just pour some on your chicken. I'm not gonna use no egg. Today I'm using my buttermilk, just like that. And I'm gonna allow this to just soak for like 15 to 20 minutes. On that burger, I'm gonna put this to the side. For this burger, I'm just going to use some garlic powder on both sides. I'm going to use some all-purpose seasoning on both sides. I'm going to also use some Obey. You just stir it in. As you can see over here, I went ahead and did my bacon. I have some lettuce, some tomato, some onion for my burger, and cheese. So guys, I'm going to go ahead and put some oil, some butter for my beef burger, and some oil for my fried chicken. So I'll be back, guys, in 20 minutes. Okay, guys, I went ahead and melted some butter. Two tablespoons of butter. Why I choose butter? Because it gives the burger more flavor. So now I'm going to add my burger. I'm going to allow my burger to cook for like 10 to 15 minutes on each side. Then I'm going to show you how I had my onion. Because I'm going to add it in the same pot to get the flavor of the burger. My 
my oil for my chicken is eating up over there and the reason why I choose this pot is because I want it to go down deep in the oil so that my chicken would cook faster cook faster and taste much better because when it do have the oil over the chicken then only the bottom part will cook and I want all my chicken to cook at the same time so guys as you can see my burger is coming along 15 to 20 minutes because I want my burger well done turn your stove down on medium heat so now guys I'm gonna take my chicken out the buttermilk after 20 minutes put it in the flour make sure flour is on it on both sides I'm not using no egg again because of the milk. You just hold it like this. Put it in the oil. Just like that guys. Next one. Could use the hand. Happy Friday guys! Take it off. Put it in the oil. Just like that. See why I choose that pot? Yes. Okay guys. I'm going to check up on my burger now. Yes. That's the way I like to see my burger. So I'm going to get 15 minutes on this side again. Lovely. I'll be back guys. So now guys I'm going to saute my onions. For my beef burger. Yummy for your tummy. This onion has the flavor with the butter and the seasoning of the burger. Learn to cook your stuff so you know exactly what is going in your tummy. And this is delicious, guys. Delicious. You don't have to go outside and eat. Make your own burger. Tune in to Carnita Love Kitchen. See? No blood coming out the burger. That's the way I like it. See? So my burger is finished. I'm just going to give my onion like another minute. Then I'm going to turn this off. My chicken is still frying over there. Get that brown juicy delicious color. I'll be right back guys so now guys I'm gonna toast the bread for like one minute because I want it to have a color inside and then I'm gonna spread my sauce on it and then I'm gonna show you so I'm just gonna put it in the toaster for like one minute then I'm gonna show you hi right, guys I'm gonna show you how I make my beef burger butter it on one side then I add my tomato salad anything you call it I add lettuce my burger then I add my onion then 
I'm going to add my other bread. Crush it down like this. And I'm going to cut it in two. And I'm going to show you. See, my burger is well done. Okay. So that's how I make my beef burger. My chicken is still cooking over there. So I'm going to show you how I pick. Oh, I make that one also guys look at my chicken beautiful after 20 minutes mmm cripsy so now guys I'm gonna show you how I do my chicken sandwich this is spicy but delicious so now guys I'm gonna add a piece of tomato I'm gonna add cheese hot in the kitchen so the cheese is melting I'm gonna add my bacon I'm gonna add a piece of lettuce then I'm gonna add my big piece of chicken breast this one now guys for this one I just use my spoon and just sprinkle it all over the chicken then I added the topping, then I squeeze it down like this, and I'm going to cut it, and then I'm going to show you what it looked like in the middle. This is juicy, yummy for your tummy. See, the bread is crispy. See guys, look at this. Oh my God. Look at this. Jeez. Okay, guys, this is what my burgers look like. I hope you enjoy. Tell a friend to tell a friend. My beef burger and my spicy, cripsy buttermilk bur chicken burger. Enjoy, guys. Have a blessed day.